My name is Calvin Jennings. Uh, I'm 15, and I found out about Outward Bound through my school. I told my college guidance counselor that I was interested in the outdoors and the sea, and she found this. And ever since then, has just been preparing to actually go on this course. I'm technically from New Orleans, but I live in New York City. And New York City, compared to Grand Manan, Canada, has tons of scenic views. And uh, you just can't get that in the city. But here in Canada, you get like a true experience of being surrounded by nature, being, being able to get lost in it. My mother's been trying to get me in and I were bound ever since I was eight or nine. And I was like, wait a second, like it's actual camping. And then I realized we don't get no showers or our phones or anything. Basically, when I got there, I was completely amazed by what I saw and it was different from what I expected. It's full on hardcore, you're in the bush. You have to deal with people you don't know, these strangers for 17 days. It's an amazing thing because you learn to get along with them, they become like some of your close friends. I'm from Saskatchewan and it's really, really like flat and that's kind of why I wanted to come to this too because it was such a beautiful part of Canada. I've always kind of struggled with like confidence in myself and I was hoping that this would help bring my confidence up. I've never done any sort of hiking or kayaking or anything like this before. I just wanted to try something different, like totally out of my comfort zone kind of thing. At the start of every day, we set up two people that are going to be on breakfast and dinner. Also, we have a cleanup crew. We wake up around like six and uh, the breakfast crew comes out. Even though it's only like two people, there you'll find like four people helping. And we use the stove to heat up things and we all just work together to create some good food to last us and help us survive and thrive. My favorite moment was uh, solo. I liked being out there by myself and making my own fire and being able to just hang out. I think they have the solo to just have everyone reflect on everything they've learnt and just take a moment to just bring everything in and just absorb it, like the sponge with the kayak. It's really interesting because for this specific trip, we have to keep watch of the sea state and we have to look ahead, check the weather reports, we have to look and make our own judgments. The instructors have been teaching us lots of skills you don't learn in school. How to read the clouds, how to tell the weather or what's coming from the weather. Like you think it's a hot day, but then they're able to tell you if it's going to go down. It was just nice to see how people who didn't know a thing, well, me being a person that didn't know a thing about kayaking, and how they just pushed us to where we're going a, like a good 10 kilometers on the open sea. You wouldn't imagine that in like a couple of days. We go from here to there. The only way you can really grow is to be pushed out of your comfort zone and to extend your comfort zone. That's basically what I See Outward Bound does. It makes your comfort zone bigger. When you come to the camp, you don't know what to expect. You've never done this before, so you don't know if you have the strength in you or the willpower in you to do it. And when you do get it done, it's just like, wow, I can actually do this. I'm, I'm able to lift a heavy kayak that's fully packed with our food, all of our clothing, our tents and you get to be proud of yourself and you learn to not rely on other people to do what you have to do. In order to benefit the group, you have to do your own part. I think the challenges that they bring forth to you, like they help you grow because if you don't fail ever, you're not gonna get anything out of it. And this course kind of like that, like you're constantly pushing yourself <laughs> in the sea, like the waves are strong, you have to keep going, you can't give up. I appreciate it hot showers. I remember when I was younger, my mom had to badger me to take a shower. I definitely, my bed, I miss my bed. This course is just making me actually appreciate home and not taking things for granted. I'm, I'm blessed with many things that I need to acknowledge that I'm blessed. Coming on this, it definitely gives you a break from your regular life. Like on the solo, I was definitely doing a lot of thinking about like myself and just it makes you realize like a lot about yourself that you didn't know was there and all the qualities you have and all the good stuff. I love just sitting down in some spots, taking a moment to just enjoy the view that nature's giving you. It's like, here's what I am. I'm not giant buildings in a city. I'm trees, I'm water, I'm, I'm land. I'm not just concrete. I'm an actual living thing. This is what I truly am. It's an amazing experience and I love it.